Good day ma'am. By the way, my name is Kim Jun Suwai Pakulba, BS Criminology from Black Charlie. This is my report about Robert Merton String Theory. Robert Merton String Theory, an American sociologist, Merton suggested that mainstream cultures, especially in the United States, is saturated with dreams of opportunity, freedom, and prosperity. As Merton thought it becomes a powerful cultural and psychological motivation, Merton also used the term anomie, but it means something slightly different for him that it did for Dirk Helm. So ang giingon ni Quandary, Robert Merton, strain, Robert Merton ay isang, siya ay isang Amerikanong sosyolohista. Si Merton ang nagmungkahi na ang pangunahing kultura, lalo na sa Estados Unidos, ay puspos ng mga pangarap ng pagkakataon, kailangan, kalayaan at kaunlaran. Gaya ng sinabi ni Merton, ito ay nagiging isang makapangyarihang kultural at psikolohikal na pangyayakak. Gumamit din si Merton ng mga terminong anumi. Ngunit ito ay nangangahulugan ng isang bagay na bahagyang naiiba para sa kaniyang kaysa ay para sa kanya kaysa ginagamit nito sa para sa Dork Helm Robert K. Merton one of the most influential sociologists of functionalist movement Merton criticized the functionalists of universal functional fun, functionalism so isa sa mga pinaka may influence ang sosyologo ng functionalist movement, binatikos ni Merton ang mga functionalist ng universal functionalism. Merton views of crime and deviance were that they were a product of this function in society. Ang mga pananaw ni Merton sa krimen at pag Lihis ay ang mga ito ay produkto ng dysfunction sa lipunan. Suggested that society was structurally unequal and that the inability of some members to achieve the American dream led to a strength to anomie. So ang gingon diri, inumungkahi na ang lipunan ay hindi pantay sa struktura at ang kawalan ng ka, kakayahan ng, ng ilang miyembro na makamit ang American Dream ay mantong sa isang strain sa anumi. Merton strain theory Merton suggested that people would react in different ways to the American. So, imungkahin ni Merton na ang mga tao ay tutugon sa mag magalang na paraan sa American Dream. Some would continue to accept socially approved goals and strive to achieve those through either legitimate or illegitimate means. So, ang ilang ang ilan ay patuloy na tatanggap ng mga kulo, kulungan na ipanaprobahan ng lipunan at magsisikap na makamit ang mga iyon sa mga pamamagitan ng alinmang sa lihit, lihimitong paraan. So, other would reject socially approved goals and either divide or conform to socially approved behaviors. Tatanggihan ng mga ng mga ng iba ang mga layunin na naprobahan ng lipunan at maaaring lumihis o umayon sa mga pag-uugaling inaprobahan ng lipunan. Deviant Adaptation to Strength First, Conformity Second, Innovation And then, Ritualism Retreatism Revelion Conformity Majority of Americans comport according to Merton And then, Teaches The American dream and work hard, gain an education and choose what we do would lead them to success. And accept social accepted social 
goals and pursue the true legitimate means. Innovation accepted the socially approved goals but found the legitimate opportunity to achieve them were black. Innovated adopted illegitimate means to achieve socially approved goals. Organizing crime fraud, white collar crime and corporation crime can link to innovation. Ritualism accepted that they were unlikely to achieve socially approved goals of wealth. Conform to the norms and values of society continue to adopt legitimate means despite knowing it would not lead to their goals. And routine occupation, adapt administrative roles, and middle management. Retreatism. Seeing routes to goals block. Retreatism. Retreatism would reject the norms and values of society. With little, with little motivation or conformity, this group out of society, according to Merton. Alcohol and drugs abuse and petty crimes. Rebellion Challenge the society socially approved goals and look to sit out their own vision of society and rejected the legitimate means of achieving these goals and would look to adopt alternative methods of achieving their vision of society. And lastly, political dis dissident activities and protesters. And lastly, eval evaluation of Merton recognized the role of structural inequality in crime and highlighted the lack of opportunities available to some groups. Strength is dependent upon people waiting to achieve socially approved goals. It is the reflective of 21 century soci society. Offer explanation for utilitarian crimes but doesn't explain crimes of fashion or why some choose to victimize other victimize others. And that's all. Thank you.